Now that we've signed into our new Scratch account, the first thing you want to do is create a new project and import the files from the lesson folder because in the lesson folder if you look year 9 how the web works modeling the DNS you've got two files one's called domains and one's called IPs these are big lists of lots of different domain names let's just open it with notepad for the moment so there are a thousand and one domain names in there and in the other file you've got a thousand and one IP addresses that match the domain names so we want to put them into Scratch so that Scratch can look at the domain name and pick the correct IP so here's how we're going to do that we're in Scratch and we click create from our home screen and we get a new project that loads up like this first of all let's give it a name let's call it DNS v1 for version 1 and now I want to create my two lists you can do that in data so I create data and I make a list my first list is going to be called domain names and you'll see that your list pops up here so to import that file I'll just right click and choose import then I need to browse to the lesson folder, lesson 4 and 5, and I've got a file called domains that I'm going to import, and I'll open it up, and you'll see that it's imported all of those domain names, and that there are 1001 of them, length 1001, in my list. Now what I need to do is do exactly the same for a, a new list called um, IPs. So you go ahead and do that and I'll see you on the next video when you've made a new list called IPs and you've imported the IP address list. Off you go.